We are Onyx Imaging. We are the highest rated and most reviewed printer service center in Oklahoma. Hey there YouTubers, it's your girl Brett over here at Onyx. Today I am going to show you the common causes of a paper jam and I'm working with an HP LaserJet Pro M401. So, um, a lot of times when you get a paper jam it's a simple um, issue to try to resolve. <clears throat> But um, just to kind of, you know, keep everything running smoothly, it is good to take these precautions when you're switching out your paper or changing your paper size. So you have these adjustments right here. You want to make sure these are locked in place to the correct size of paper that you are currently using. So if you have legal, you'd want it um, on the legal, it even says LGL for legal. Um, if you're doing envelopes, you can move the size here to make it a little... Um, more the size of the envelope. Just make sure they are locked into the correct place. If not, it will cause issues of a paper, um, for a paper jam and it could also pop a code. So make sure those are in place. Then the next thing I like to do, anytime I'm adding paper to my printer, I never just wanna take the old paper and put it on top of the new paper in here because a lot of times it will be uneven and the rollers will try to pick up the paper that's on the bottom instead of the top paper like it's supposed to. Then in result, it'll try to pick up too many pieces of page papers or um, it'll curl it over in result causing a jam. So I like to take both pieces of, or both piles of paper, fan it out. We live in Oklahoma, so condensation is always in the air, humidity. Um, so fan it out because the condensation can make the pages stick together. Then just make sure to line it all up so it is even. Then stick it in your tray. If you guys are in need of any supplies or quotes, give your girl Brett a call and have a great day. We are Onyx Imaging. We are the highest rated and most reviewed printer service center in Oklahoma.